Okay, you guys, so I don't even know what happened at the last part of that, but I'm going to go ahead and finish it out because everything just froze up. Everything, the light, computer, everything. Could have been spirit, could have been some technical glitch. I don't know why everything fucked up at the same time, but it did. So for some of you, definitely this could be a love relationship or this could be something that you are closing out as far as pushing a third party out of your situation. I get victory with this for a lot of people. So for a lot of people, if you've been dealing with somebody that's been causing problems within a relationship, let me get the card. I feel like you're coming out on top because you're putting your foot down and you're saying, you know what? I know everything that happened, but I'm willing to forgive that and reconcile with you. I'm willing to move forward with you. So for a lot of you, whether this is a friend that did you dirty a lot of you are like, okay, I'm going to go ahead and give you a clean slate because I still have some emotional ties. Now, for some, I definitely feel like if this is a reconciliation that you feel like because you have emotional um, connections to them, be really, really careful. And the only reason I say that is because of this card. Whether this is a friend, a work colleague, or somebody that you're dealing with, if you have somebody that's trying to manipulate you, even if this is a spouse, you could be dealing with somebody that is extremely jealous or envious of what you're trying to do. They may not want to see you grow, even though you may have feelings for them and you may feel like, OK, we can be friends. I want to reconcile with you. I want to put everything um, to the to the to the back burner and, and do a clean slate. This person may not be able to do this because this is a lot of jealousy and envy. They may be, okay, 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 let's do it. Let's go ahead and move it forward. But then as soon as you go ahead and you let your guard down, you may mess around and get bit again by this person. Because I just feel like so much manipulation could be going on. And for a lot of you, because of your emotional connection with this person, you may not want to see you may not have you may not want to see that this person is doing this. So if it is a friendship, if it is a relationship that's important to you and you're having a hard time letting go, all I'm going to say is if you don't want to untie your hands right now, take the blinder off. Take the blinder off so you can see the manipulation and then speak up. Say what you have to say. If you have to part with this person because there's nowhere to go with this anymore, then you got to let it go, especially if you have to watch your back with somebody that you feel like is supposed to be a good friend or somebody close to you. But for some of you, you may have to. For a lot of you, I feel like the energy of this person may be so much that you don't want to keep that connection going. And you got to do what's best for you. If you feel like you're overwhelmed, trying to hold on to somebody that literally is toxic or bringing something into your life that is not productive, then you may have to cut them loose. For some of you, like I said, and it won't be for everybody, some of you are willing to forgive and reconcile. Whether this is a love relationship or a friendship, some of you are willing to give this person another chance because you do care about them. So really within this equation, kind of fall in where you fit. You know, if it doesn't fit, don't force it. I feel like that way with a relationship, whether it's a romantic relationship or a friendship, if people show you something that you really can't let go of and it's a deal breaker, then it's a deal breaker. There's no point of this. But if you still have love and you're confused about your feelings, then you need to have a conversation with the person and figure out, you know, this is the last time. If I feel like you're doing this to me again, you know, some people get fucked by the same person four, five, six times. And it's because of their heart. You know, I don't want to see you for what you really are, but sometimes you have to. You got to take the blinders off. You got to deal with a situation that you don't want to see. You can't walk around life like this because this will be more detrimental to you than it would be to the other people around you. All right. So concludes the message for the cards. Thank you so much. Love you. Have a beautiful day. Be safe for the holiday and I'll see you soon. Mwah.